So you've decided to give Studio One a go. Well, awesome. Thanks and welcome to the family. If you didn't get Studio One in one of our hardware products, then you most likely purchased it from one of our retailers around the world or on shop.personos.com. So that means your authorization code was either emailed to you or the retailer provided it to you directly or you'll find it in your Studio One product box. This serial number is what you have to enter in your mypersonas.com account to claim your product. So just head over to my.personas.com and register your account. Once you're logged in, you can simply click on register your product and then you just enter the serial number that you've received with your email. If you've purchased one of our interfaces, mixers or controllers, which all come with Studio One artists included, then simply state your hardware serial number instead along with the purchase date. You will find the serial number either on the back side or at the bottom of the unit. In my case, I've just registered a Studio 26C and as you can see, that product list doesn't just include Studio One artists, but also the Studio Magic Bundle, which is all these different fantastic plugins from industry leading developers. And that in itself is already worth a thousand dollars. You're also gonna find the manual for your hardware unit, as well as Universal Control, which is our driver software plus control software for your hardware unit. And of course, the Studio One installer. To download, simply click on more details. This is where you're gonna find the installer for Studio One, as well as all the sound sets, which you can also download from Studio One directly, plus many helpful videos from me and other colleagues to keep you going. Upon the first start, Studio One is gonna ask you for your My Personas credentials that you can then enter just like you did with the website. As soon as you've done that, Studio One Artist is gonna go ahead and activate itself. And that's it, you just activated Studio One. The installation pop-up should show up right away and you will be able to install all of your additional content, demos and tutorials. Should you click that away the first time, then you can always access it from the menu bar.